So I'm checking out this head. This head was okay. It had good compression on all four cylinders. Uh, I just removed it to change the valve seals. And while I do, while I've got it on the bench here, I, I, I want to just see how it holds water back. So I've got it tilted up with a lab jack. And I'm just putting enough water in there to go around the seals where it's going to seal. And I'm just curious if it's going to leak. Because uh, I've, I've got another head over there that had some work done on it. And I want to compare the difference, make sure that that other head was... Uh, properly made properly uh, restored so I'm gonna check in on this one first and see uh, it looks like it's holding pretty good I don't know for sure I haven't been able to look around to the intake side but I'll just put water on there and check it I mean it's not rushing out of there that's <laughs> that's a good thing So uh, pretty cool. It's uh, I don't see any whirlpool of water like whoosh, going down. I'm, I can check these uh, intakes here. I don't see anything, and I can take a peek at the exhaust. It's hard to see though, but they look good. This this head, uh, like I said, this head was okay. It had good compression on all four cylinders but I just wanted to get a baseline and now I'm going to take a look at this other head that uh, has come back from the machine shop and I just want to confirm that it behaves similarly to this one because this one was good so now I'm going to see if I can use my syringe to get this water out of here some of it anyway And I get the rest of the paper towel. So this one looks pretty good. I'm happy with what I'm seeing. Don't see any obvious leaks. And so um, now I know what to look for when I, I'm going to check out the other head here and make sure that it seals equally as well as this one did. And I fully expect that it will. Make room for that head. So I'll set it right over here. Put the new head here. I need to turn this puppy around, it looks like. Nope, had it right to begin with. So you can see this one's a little shinier. And I'm going to put some water in there and see what happens to this one.
So I just got this head back from the machine shop. It's got new exhaust valves in it. I just want to check and make sure that's sealing properly. So I'm going to put water around there. Looking good so far. I just want to make sure that the, they did a fair job of seating these valves so they seal. Don't see any leaks. Looks good so far. I think it's good. I don't see any crazy leak. So I feel good about this head too. I'm going to go ahead and uh, get the water out of it. And clean them up and put them, put them on my block. Wasn't sure what to expect. I was, well, I was expecting it to seal, you know. It would just be disheartening if it if it leaked. That would mean maybe uh, it would burn a valve or something if it was leaking exhaust gas past it. Nice, here we go, that one's good. So that concludes the test, and I'm happy with the results. This evidently was a junkyard head, it's got a lot of writing in it. And there's some kind of wire that I would not want in my cooling system. From a wire brush probably when they cleaned it up but yeah that'll be uh, installing them on that engine there later <laughs>